Hey guys, it's Brennan the Paleo Dude. I'm back with another Paleo Nerds video. And today we'll be um, basically just putting all these Jurassic Park movie dinosaurs into these lovely tiers here that Dapper has um, volunteered to name. So today I'm here with Allie, Dapper, and Finn from the Paleo Nerds. And um, we're going to have some fun. Hello, dear. Hi. There they are. So... Should we start with Allosaurus, guys? Yeah, we'll sure. start from the beginning. Yeah. Okay. Um, I don't know where to put him. Her. Them. Allo? Okay, so do we want to include Battle of Aircraft? Is Nasuto Ceratops on this list? Um, Nasuto? I don't think Nasuto's in this list. Hmm. We could hmm. just take it at face value. I think I'd put it in the Great Creatures. Love to see him. Because, like, you know, it's cool to see. It doesn't really do much, but, you know, it's something cool to see in the background. Exactly. I felt the same way when I saw it. Um, I wanted to see more of it, but um, just seeing it alone is pretty nice representation. Good that yeah, you did. In. Battle of Big Rock. That was yeah, Battle of Big Rock was epic. That was really good. Man. It was. Oh, on that, the new Dominion trailer, one of the teaser trailers, it shows the adult Allosaurus knocking something a over, like a big, a big thing over. That was pretty. Oh yeah, cool. I heard about that. So yeah. basically, Thanks, what that yeah, scene yeah. is, what that scene is, is basically the uh, battle at Big Rock. That whole sequence is going to be in the movie, but from a different perspective, like somebody in like another van watching the fight go on, which is going to be awesome. like a point of view. Yeah, like another huh. point of view. That's what I heard. I hope that's the case. That'd be pretty fun. Good tie-in. Mm -hmm. Let's do... Yeah, definitely. Is there... Okay, Paris there. So this is Crethosaurus. Let's do Crethosaurus yeah. next. Crethosaurus? Crethosaurus, uh, Cretho. I, yeah, like, like, I say right. both. I think Camp Cretaceous. Because, I mean... That'd be cool that'd be to see pretty Camp cool Cretaceous. To see Camp Cretaceous but... Where is Camp Cretaceous? Yeah. Right there. That would be it's really pretty... nice. I, it needs to do more, even though it probably won't, because it's overshadowed by Parasaurolophus. But yeah. it's it's a cool dinosaur for. I feel is. yeah. Do much. I feel like it would have a nice scene similar to how the galleys were introduced into the last season of Camp Cretaceous. Yeah, that'd be cool. Mm -hmm. Um, and Kylosaurus. Oh, um, Ooh. definitely pretty high. Now, I think. Yeah. Probably like the Would legend. You... Yeah, I think ones. I've the legends too. Yeah, it's really good. <sighs> Wait, give me a second. I gotta. There we go. <laughs> yes. How many movies love... is there now? JP three. Three. It's Jurassic three. World. Three. Yeah. Oh, it's also in Dominion. So four. Mm -hmm. Even though it's not out. Get a lot of bonus points. Um, yeah. What was I gonna say? Oh yeah. Um, I rewatched Jurassic World for this tier list recently. Uh, and it was better than I remember, and the Impalosaurus scene was actually pretty entertaining, even though it loses, but it's still a really cool little scene where, like, an herbivore kind of fights back. Exactly! It's not really something yeah, but you it see still in gets Jurassic. It yeah. still gets its, like, butt beaten. That's the sad somehow thing. The in, somehow the Indominus Rex survives a hit to the face. <laughs> yeah, like, what somehow. the heck? Maybe it wasn't, like, a full power swing or something. Yeah. So where should we drop Baryonyx? Meh, I don't like it. it I, has I love it stupid... personally. I don't we could know. put it in the love Ooh. and hate it. We, we, oh, yeah. Good thing yeah. you made that. <laughs> it exists. Love it, love it for its inaccuracies, hate it for its inaccuracies. Yeah, I, I hate its scenes and I like hate it. its design. I think um, in Fallen Kingdom, it was all right, but the trio in Camp Cretaceous really gave it a lot of points because of like, oh, how they acted. Oh, like, as a, yeah, I was as just, a family. I was just... Yeah, I was just thinking about this, like the um, the movie. So mm -hmm. I guess the show kind of like did it better. Made them feel less the, like monsters and were like more animals. Like you know, with the baryonic scene in Fallen Kingdom, like the lava, like I don't, mm -hmm. how, how didn't the lava kill it? They wouldn't kill it. They just make it very hurt. Like I like think. that could just burn it. Like that could just burn it or something. We should drop like lava on an games. alligator and see what happens. I mean, not <laughs> actually, like in a simulation, not no animal oh cruelty. My oh, why are you simulations? We'd use like a high tech <laughs> simulation. We'd make a fake alligator with like oh my god, real skin. No, I mean fake skin. Why? <laughs> I'm not. Mm. Oh guys, I'm not into crocodile mm. cruelty. I'm not. 
Just, just scope the alligator. Just scope the alligator or a crocodile. Just scope it. Yeah. it. Kind of yeah, I was thinking more like a, a simulated alligator, <laughs> <laughs> not a live one. Oh uh, my god. Okay, Brachio next. I mean, a pato. Oh, that's a pato. Well, it's an, for me, it's in the legends, even though it doesn't do much. It has Go. to do more in Camp Cretaceous, please. Yes, it's why a... wasn't it in Camp Cretaceous? I was so mad well, at it. Well, there oh, wait, is there actually was some genocided. good news. No, there is some good news yeah, in the though. Rip um, and Kalasaur says it just got there are, killed by the there Indominus in Jurassic World. Uh, they're legends, and both will... of them got murked by the Indominus. Yeah. Yeah, um, and Kalasaurus. There's some rumors that the Apatosaurus will appear in Camp Cretaceous because, like, there's this one shot in, like, the writer's room or whatever, and has, like, this huge, like, whiteboard full of dinosaur names. And one of them, under the name or under the title Wishlist, is Apatosaurus. So there's something to hope for. Is But they're not on the island anymore. They're going, well, that's why everyone's thinking, oh, they're going to go use the Sorna. I guess there, Which, there it, is it, a Patasaurus on Isla Sorna. That's a logical step Probably. forward, yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. I can see that. That's the best way to go. Okay, Carno. Mm, I think Lucas should say something about the Carno. Oh, yeah, I added him. I think he... Uh, oh, he left. he left. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Oops. Um, the Carno was uh, really great in um, yeah, Fallen Kingdom. When I was introduced. I'm surprised they um, put it in. Fallen Kingdom, actually, when I first saw the trailer, I remember I was super shocked that they put it in. Yeah, like, finally. The design is great as well. And then yeah. it just gets killed. And it just gets killed. Yep. Murked I'm, I'm disappointed that it didn't have the camouflage, like, in the novel. That would have been even yeah, better. I know, that would have been epic. Yeah. Mm, yeah, yeah, imagine, like, been. imagine, like, a bunch of uh, mercenaries, like, going to, like, the forest. And then yeah. Like, yeah. Too wave. bad the Indominus had that. Out. Oh, that would yeah. be so... Yeah. Okay, wait, wait. wait. Yeah. Let's put it in... Legend? I think it's, it's camouflage. Yeah, maybe maybe higher invisible. than Allosaurus and great creatures. Yeah, I, I don't in know. The great creatures. Yeah. Okay. Or there what we go. you guys think? No, I think that's good. Brachio, Brachio. Okay, oh, well, go, come on go. now. Be good. There's no debate. Yeah. You... I still can't get over I still can't get over the death in Fallen Kingdom. <laughs> oh. I think that just brought too too much nostalgia, but I cry. Serato. He does nothing. He sniffs poop. I think I put it in meh. Like they did put it in uh, Camp Cretaceous, and that was great. But it yeah, yeah. At this point, it, it, it's it kind of like it had this a similar vibe to seeing Ankylosaurus and Crithosaurus in JP3 and then some dancers are just punching and, bags in yeah. the, in Jurassic Park yeah yeah and then and then like punching bags they used Ankylosaurus in Jurassic World and that was great and then we got Ceratosaurus in Evolution then we saw it in Camp Cretaceous and it appeared in the toy lines many times and it just got kind of watered down you know what was great though um well, not for the Serato because it dies, but I loved <laughs> when you see the Ceratosaurus in season three and it's just walking and then bam, it's taking down the uh, yeah, Rex. Right. It's, it's, it's like a, it's there. a good show of the animal strength and, and mm-hmm. aggression and lifestyle. Mm-hmm. Um, I, I like that scene too. What about the Compi? Oh, I think legendary because like their scenes in yeah. the last world are so good. Oh, yeah. I love like that. The in dogs. the novel, they are absolutely horrifying. Oh my yeah. god, yes. so one scary! Bay, Eating babies, babies and hammond. <laughs> yes, wow. Killed that by was... his own creation. Pulling yeah. out pieces of flesh. I was like morbidly yikes. You know, there was a um, what's it called? Freaking a novel. There was a rehash of the novel that was put out like in 2019, and it was like basically the same novel, but there were illustrations included. With it. Oh, I saw one that one. Them, yeah, one of them was the compi eating like the babies in like, a little baby carriage. It was terrifying. <laughs> that's pretty weird. They, they should do that in Dominion. Yeah. They should do a scene like that in Dominion. I don't think that'd they would, cool. but that'd be cool. Like it would be cool to like see like a remake of them. It's like Snyder that'd be, verse, but that'd like be breaking. Are. That'd be breaking one of Jurassic Park's solid rules where no ch- child shall ever die. Uh, uh, Bob Maisie. Bob Maisie. You shouldn't see. Yeah, didn't exactly. she die? But she's a clone. She's not. So they just oh. broke that rule. No, no, no. no. She mom. died off so the screen. It'd be super yeah, but, funny if there's yeah. it became like a clone army. Oh <laughs> Star God. Wars. So much amazing. Amazing Wars. <laughs> oh yeah, wait. Um Order 66 happens. 
Oh, God. oh, oh no, God. execute all. Oh, Kill God. the dinosaurs. <laughs> What's next? Uh, Dilophosaurus. It needs to do more. I would put it in Legends, but... Dilophosaurus like, should return. People... Yeah, I'd put it in Great... great or, Dilophosaurus yeah, great should return. Or no, no, um, Camp Cretaceous, that makes sense, yeah. I, yeah, I'd I like to see it in Camp Cretaceous. That would yeah, be a yeah. Yeah. If Dilophosaurus doesn't come back in Dominion, I'm going to raid Universal Studios. Um, that's you. a theme park. No, jo- the, evade the um. They um yeah they field. film there and stuff. <laughs> I'm just not, imagine not this, Ali not, raiding not the, the theme park and everyone's wait, like wait, uh. Wait, not the theme no, park, raid, the actual studio. Wait, like raid the office, specifically like. Jurassic World the ride. There we go. Specifically that location. <laughs> Ali throws <laughs> raptors at the tour tour bus. <laughs> the tour bus. So he, eats, he eats the whole Mosasaurus. You know, there was a dialogue drawing in uh, Darius's book. Field exactly. In, um, go and he, owned, he was drawing those because he saw them, so. I gotta mm. go by. It exists. Oh, okay. So All right. Bye, Ali. See ya. See ya. What's next? Oh. The Morphodon. Ew, the Morphodon. I hate it. Ugh, gross. Uh, I put it in the rubber dinosaur quality. Okay, Gally's. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, I think we all agree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, wait, before we put down the galley, I want to talk a little more about the Morphron. Um, it was okay. I like that it had pigno fibers. That was cool, but it kind of just looks like more like a rat. It looks like a, it looks like a, a rat flying sky rat. Not I mean, honestly, rat. I kind of have the, f- the same feel how I like Baryonyx. I like its rat-like design for being very odd and and grossly inaccurate like most of the dinosaurs where it's like mm-hmm. it's got you can tell what dna's been used to monsterify it right Rah. it, it gives <laughs> it like a unique uh, appeal it's less like the actual elegant modern animal or not modern but you know real design and mm-hmm. more of this oh my god the monster. work on sighted in the uk or wherever oh um, my god bet um yeah also, uh, I don't like how they fold their wings. It bothers me so much. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, let's move on to the galley. Ready to go. Oh, there um, it is. I got it. There it is. I was mm-hmm. mildly surprised when it popped up in the Camp Cretaceous. That was pretty cool. Mm-hmm. Um, I don't have too strong of feelings about it. My great way to describe it, in my opinion, would just be the feeder dino. Like Aww. it exists to be eaten. It's great, but it exists to be eaten. That's yeah, Crithosaurus. Well, think. I mean, Crithosaurus don't haven't died. Though. I mean, there haven't been any on screen. Just a hadrosaur, pretty yeah. much. <laughs> roasted, smaller. big roasted, big toasted. Indominus. Oh my God! Here we go. Controversy time. Oh God. Um, I, it's the first hybrid. Has grown. I actually, on me i used to not like it very much but i think it's pretty cool when i first saw it and like when i was a little kid i was terrified of it but really i got yeah I, I was like seven at the time when the movie came out so i was like oh my god uh um, yeah so yeah, i was uh, a little baby so <laughs> when it i love the i wish they used the uh, camouflage abilities more yeah they I only showed up very once interesting scenes. yeah well twice twice it showed up twice and camp cretaceous um, gave us a nice extra look at it but it did it didn't just it didn't feel enough did it camouflage in camp cretaceous yes just once it, like it remember oh. when the kids are like up in the tower and then the two dudes are like get down here and then the indominus rex comes out and just eats all of them oh okay this was like right after it killed the bracky also speaking of the indominus rex seems to be very invincible yeah, <laughs> like <laughs> title card hmm. shows up. How does it survive in a Pylosaurus club to the face and then goes on to kill an entire herd of a Petasaurus on its own? How does it have that much energy? That was one day, one day of killing. Yeah, no, yeah, it's like, wait, how do you take down a 25 ton animal with a giant whip like tail and like there's six of them? No, 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 yeah. no, 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 this is about Petasaurus. Yeah, it's, it's weird, but it, but. I understand why they did that narratively, just to show like how dangerous the Indominus Rex is. So that's pretty cool. 
It had like arguably the best death scene in the franchise for sure. Oh yeah, that was pretty Game legendary. That was awesome. <laughs> WWE SmackDown. What's okay. next? Okay, let's do Indo Raptor. Oh no. You guys have In- anything to say about it? Indo Raptor. Uh, no. um, yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah, I agree with that. Uh, oh wait, where'd you put it? Oh, dumpster yeah. fire. Yeah. It it wasn't that bad. I just uh, they could have done they could have done it more kind of like E seven fifty, but I guess it was like supposed to be the uh, slim down version, more sleek for military. But like just something about the design was too slippery, too slim. I yeah. like I like the interactor, but I don't like it because it's underused potential. Like yeah. it's like not scary in my opinion. Like the Aranosaurus and Camp Cretaceous are arguably more scary than the Indoraptors. Yeah, like, the Aranosaurus were unpredictable behemoths piling uh, through because they're just sheer, sheer bulk and anger. Large um, I, I guess it. I guess it was also the, the setting, the, the mood, the mood. The mood I think yeah, is what made them more scary. Yeah, in, it's always relatively. those um shipping containers anything to do with shipping containers and it makes for a frightening situation in a dinosaur movie i just gotta say i really? love shipping container settings for <laughs> movies shipping especially containers like great. in the dark yeah oh, you, you know can't what? see around them and you can hide mm. it's like a maze you know what comes to mind uh dra- telltale's uh dress park yes they, yes they, yes they have like a segment at the end with the t-rex yep. they had the, the t-rex and the shipping the containers one of the deaths you can get squished between them <laughs> oh, shoot, oh my god damn, that's sad. <laughs> yeah um, that's pretty intense i think they should have made the indoraptor either more like brutal like brutalistic like watch it like hunt more like what if it like broke out of the cage during the auction and just like went on a murder spree that would have been really yeah cool. of people or, and then see it kill some dinosaurs and then they really got to take it down yeah i mean no 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 literally like it only got like five kills because like, I watched Dead Me, if you guys know what that YouTube channel is, but you know. Yeah, I know what it is. Yeah, but like, no one has five like, kills. No one yeah. has five confirmed kills. Uh, or and then, what and then, they also could have did. It, oh, I'm sorry, am I interrupting? Oh, oh yeah, because I just I'm gonna add, and he died by mm-hmm. a Velociraptor and uh, Star Lord. So. Yeah. Yeah. What they also met- could have did to make. Oh, sorry. Oh no, no, you can go. You can go. You can. Okay. What they also could have did to make the interrupter more scary, so option B, is to kind of just make it like you don't so you don't see it during the movie. Like I a great example to refer to is have you guys watched Primal? Of course. Uh, or are you familiar with it? One hundred percent. The night feeder is something to draw attention to. Like you don't see it until the very end of the movie. Like, of course we would know what it looked like, but I think if they made it so that like the manor was like in complete darkness and you don't see the indirector at all until the end <gasps> like for example like it, you see it kill people but you don't see it like physically and yeah and you the hear that like, you hear the, it in like, like rooms and too. stuff yeah and then when you at the like the end where it fights blue that's when you'd see like the entire thing so that like all of this tension is built up to like bam it's the indirector you know they could have also did that I think that would have definitely cool. gave it a way better impact Instead I think of just it also, running around. I think it would also have been like if they didn't really like tell everyone about what it's gonna be and like like I think it would just be more ominous and everything, you know. Yeah, mm-hmm. exactly. But, I agree. Yeah, overall the dumpster fire. Just unwait I mean wasted potential. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm very sad. Another that. cool thing, we didn't actually get to see this in the film, but if you scanned the Mattel toys into the game. Both of them say that it has echolocation like a bat. We did not oh, get yeah, to see that. that. If yeah. if the whole mansion would have been pitch black, which would have been perfect, it could have used that sonar, that echolocation, and we would have got to see or hear that in some capacity. Yeah, it, would also, yeah. it would be like super cool to have like a Last of Us vibe, you know, if you've played that game. It's yeah, I've good. seen it. I yeah, think I played it. Dark and spooky. Yeah. Um... So just What's just next? wasted potential. Let's do my Menchisaurus. Yeah. My Menchisaurus, I like to call it Diplodocus because um, <laughs> excuse me. Look at its, yeah, okay. Let me explain. So if you look at its marquette, it's literally a Diplodocus, but with a Menchisaurus head, and it slapped the name Menchisaurus on the title. 
because it's if you look at it for what it is in the movie, it looks more like a Diplodocus than a Mechisaurus. Interesting. I think, I think it would be like Camp Cretaceous. I yeah. would love to see it in Camp Cretaceous for sure. Especially if they That's go to Site B. Sauropod. Okay, oh we got God. seven minutes left, Moza. All right, let's speed, let's speed run time. Speed run. Right. <laughs> okay, Moza, uh, I love it. So just put it in the great creatures. Great creatures. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, Packy. Um, I like. Wait, is Cynoceratops? Oh, it's in here. Oh, Packy, Packy. Uh uh-huh, Packy. Camp I think Cretaceous. It would be, yeah, Camp Cretaceous. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Camp Cretaceous. Para. Para. Well, oh come on, you know where I want to put that one. Oh, of course. <laughs> Simp. Wait, wait what? <laughs> I think it would be legendary. Hadrosaurs are great. I mean, Parasaurus is great. Needs to there do more, go. though. Yeah. yeah. Oh. I remember Jeez. when all the ones, the um, the bioluminescent ones were just slaughtered in a row. Oh, my God. Those, They're that, all those... running. It was like left, right, and Dude, center. that was oh my an God. awesome scene. I love that scene. Like, of course, they all died, and that sucks. But, like, that was a great scene. Like, just because, <laughs> like, they come out of nowhere. You don't see the bioluminescent parasaurs for, like, a good two seasons. And then when they come back, it's cool. It's cool little record. Mm-hmm. Uh, the terrors, oh. I love, terrors are great. Oh. Why didn't they have the Lost World terrors? Or, no, Lost the, World. And, sorry, the oh. JP3 ones. This is sad. This one's the a better version, like anyways. It's beautiful. Yeah. yeah. The, I like how brutal the Jurassic World Terminator are. I, I'm not yeah. a big fan of the design, but I like how brutal they are. It's cool. I like how brutal the um, JP3 ones are. That was intense. Oh, yeah. Tri- Real tri- horror tri- movie. movie. Yeah. Wait, I haven't watched JP3 in a while. Wasn't the assistant named, like, Brennan? <laughs> yeah, Billy Brennan. <laughs> <laughs> that is a little <laughs> sus. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? Uh, one day in the news, you'll see uh, Brennan the Paleo Dude drowned by Tyrannodons. <laughs> I would not want to see that in the news. I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> it's not good on my part. <laughs> yeah. Spinosaurus. <sighs> love it or hate it. I love yeah. it. I know love you it, guys it. hate it. Very si- No, very similar points to the Indominus, I think. They're very similar in terms of like, not like what they look like, but they how just they can't serve be killed. as a rule. Yeah. Big Although you gotta admit, shook up the cinemas when it killed the Rex. You gotta give it that. Mm-hmm. For a moment. What about yeah. Stego? Oh, come on. Go. Legendary. Go. Oh, yeah. Go. go. Yeah. Go. 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 We're Legendary. goating it. Mm-hmm. Oh, Brachio and Stego is in Goat. That's so cool. Okay. Yeah. Stiggy. Or Stiggy. Stiggy. Nah. I put it in nah. Nah. Packy is cooler, in my opinion. Of yeah. course. I like, I like how it's a comedic role, but Packy's just cooler. Yeah. How about Tri- 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 Okay, I'd put that in Camp Cretaceous because it's... Oh, yeah! Like, it's one of those dinosaurs where it's like, it's super famous and popular, but you don't see it do anything besides lay down and die, essentially. <laughs> yeah, what the heck? <laughs> Why, we haven't seen it do anything. Why yeah, can't Camp Tri- Cretaceous... does nothing. <gasps> it, it appears would be in so every movie, cool. but it just appears in the background scene. One yeah, thing I'd yeah. like to see it do would be to fight uh, Rexy and Dominion. Oh my that god, that would actually scene. be super cool. Because, like, think about it. We haven't gotten a Triceratops versus T-Rex fight, which is arguably, like, the most famous dinosaur duel ever. Exactly. That's so, so yeah, weird. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's weird to think about. It's like I oh, thought yeah, maybe in Camp Cretaceous we might have gotten something. Yeah, I was I really know, we have season four. To appear in season three. But yeah, we can hope for season four. Yeah, T-Rex. there are trikes on the lot, the second island. So, yeah, oh, Tyrannosaurus yeah. dumpster fire. It's dumpster what? fire. It's goaded. <laughs> what do you mean? It's, sure, it's uh, overrated. It's the most famous dinosaur. Yeah, put it at goaded. Put it at goaded. Come on now. It's fine, great. fine. I'll put it at goaded. We we gotta we gotta appease dapper. <laughs> it, no, no, it is. It, it is the best it's dinosaur good. in the whole. Thing that yeah, it's it like is. it's the, it's the tr- it's the hallmark. You have to give it respect. Of course. Okay, Velociraptor. Velociraptor. Let's go. What do you Goated. guys think? Goated. Mm. Goated. Oh, oh yeah. I mean, like I mean, if no scientific. Yeah. Whatever. If we throw it's science goated. out the window, it's goaded. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And since so this is like our... a overall, uh, I've got to say overall most goaded JP three Raptors. Let's go. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> well, I wanted to say real quick 
what do you guys think of the Jurassic World Raptors versus the JP uh, JP three, JP two, and JP one Raptors? Oh, like, what's ooh. your opinion on that? Mm. I definitely love the Lost World and um, JP three Raptors. I feel like yeah, they they're like they're slowly getting more accurate, and then nope, going back. The mm-hmm. interesting thing is a lot of people say that they're like puppy dogs. I mean, the Jurassic World Raptors, and I agree to an extent. Like, sure, in the Jurassic World one, they are like little minions, but I like that in Camp Cretaceous and in Fallen Kingdom, actually, you can see that blue is kind of reverted back to this sort of primal sort of nature and is more aggressive. Mm-hmm. Not as aggressive mm-hmm. as like the, the tiger raptors, mind you, because they're my favorites. And, oh, yeah. In the novel, yeah, they're the most aggressive. Yeah, they're eating amazing. their own babies. And I love stuff. the tiger raptors, but while they're not as aggressive as the tiger raptors, blue still serves as a really good minor antagonist in um, Camp Cretaceous. I mean, you can say she's kind anti-hero. of minor antagonist. Yeah, anti-hero. anti-hero. Sure, because they helped, <laughs> she helped kill the scorpion 50 or whatever. <laughs> scorpion 50. Yikes. Speaking oh, yeah. of. Where would we put that? I'd I feel put like that m- in... Meh. Yeah, I love okay. it. It's, it's scary. I'll give it that. It's really scary. How about scary. Monolophosaurus? Where would we put that? I think I'd put it in meh as well. It's good, decent, you know. Yeah. Nothing much mm-hmm. to say. And then Aronosaurus would probably go in great creatures. Bias. Yeah, great creatures. We got to put yeah, that in. Love to see them in Camp Cretaceous. No, I'm just kidding. It's already in there. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Definitely great creatures. Love to see them. Yeah. That needs to yeah. be in live action. Ooh, I mean, it probably won't, we... but mm-hmm. I'd love to see it in live action. Before we wrap up, we have to talk about the Giganotosaurus. <laughs> Oh my god! I was oh, gonna say yeah. that. We have to talk. We have to talk about that real quick. So Less than a minute left. Let's go. What do you guys uh, think? It's it's ugly. I, I like the back lot. thing, but it shouldn't be in the prehistoric age. That is what its clone should look it's like. It's ugly, and it's why is it battling with Tyrannosaurus? Imagine, imagine the video just cuts off here. <laughs> <laughs> we should cut it off here. I'm getting scared. Thirty seconds, probably. Oh, we left. All right. Okay. Bye. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one. Oh shoot.